Hello again, everybody. Tim from timscomputerfix.net. Well, quick video here. It is January 20th, 2020. And as we all know, Windows 7 has been discontinued by Microsoft. They do not support it anymore. So here we have a copy of Windows 7 freshly installed on this machine that came through my shop. And you can see here it's activated. Everything's good there. The question being is, can we still do a free upgrade? And that is the question to Windows 10. That's what we're going to find out right here. So, I have me Windows 10 installation media and we're going to try to upgrade this PC. Plug this guy in here and I have network I have a network connection. So let's see if Microsoft has kept their up, upgrading servers running as far as Windows keys and everything. So we'll open up that folder and let's just run setup here and see what happens. Select yes. And let's see if Microsoft is still allowing the free upgrades to Windows 10 from Windows 7 now that Windows 7 is end of life officially. We are going to find out. We're going to say install Windows 10 and now it's checking for updates. We do have network connection and now they're getting a few things ready. I would have imagined they would let people still upgrade. I don't know what they would gain out of just cutting that off. Microsoft wants as many people as possible on Windows 10. It's obvious and that's, that's been obvious through the life of Windows 10. Okay, a little bit of a license and terms there. We'll agree to that. Now it's making sure I'm ready to install. It's getting updates ready. So this is looking like it's going to go through now. The question is, is when you go through the upgrade process, is it going to ask for a license key? Okay, this is going to install Windows 10 Pro. And we, you know, we can keep whatever personal files because there's really nothing on here. This was a fresh install that I had to do on a Windows 7 computer that has not yet touched Windows 10. There is no activation for Windows 10 on Microsoft servers for this computer. So this is a perfect computer to try this on. We'll hit install. And there we go. Installing Windows 10. So this looks like uh, this is going to go through after all. We'll check back when it's complete. 6% right now. Loading files. And now we are going to officially be booting into Windows 10. We're going to see if we're activated. So, of course, we got to go through all these updates here. We'll get that done. More updates. We'll let that roll on through. And we will see. And here we go right into Windows 10. Let's see what we got. All you want to do is know that it's activated and then we'll know. Oh yeah, this stuff. No, oh, let's quit. No, 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 no. Except 
And here we go. Okay, so we're going to go into the settings here and go to update and security. And activation. Here we go. Windows is activated with a digital license. There we go, everybody. Looks like Microsoft is letting you still upgrade for free from the end of life Windows 7 to Windows 10. I think that's smart of them. They've always have done it. Why stop it now? So there's your answer. Hey guys, have a great YouTube day. Hey, if you enjoyed this video, why don't you head right down below here, hit that like button, subscribe to my channel. That would be really awesome. I have much more computer repair videos coming your way. There's also a bell you can click for to get notifications for my videos. I really appreciate everybody's support. And as usual, everyone, until next time, see you soon.